30 Nobel laureates have joined global human rights and environmental NGOs calling for an end to the home detention of human rights lawyer Stephen Donziger. Donziger played a key role in winning the landmark $9.5 billion judgment in Ecuador against Chevron for its deliberate pollution of the Amazon rainforest while operating as Texaco from 1964 to 1992. He has become Chevron's target in the company's stated campaign to, quote, demonize Donziger, unquote. In 2011, Chevron was found liable and ordered to pay $9.5 billion for deliberately polluting the Amazon by dumping 16 billion gallons of toxic waste into the rainforest, causing a massive health crisis. Instead of paying the judgment, Chevron withdrew its assets and fled the country. 916 toxic waste pits remain, poisoning the local drinking water to this day. Chevron should focus on a complete cleanup. Instead, with support from a U.S. federal judge, Chevron is attempting to silence Donziger and those who support him. Framed by Chevron with false evidence and testimony from a bribed witness, the judge has ordered Donziger to turn over his email passwords, phone, and computer to the court to give to Chevron. When Donziger appealed the order, the judge charged him with criminal contempt, seized his passport, and placed him in home detention. Donziger has been convicted of no crime, yet remains under house arrest for over eight months, unable to pursue justice for the Ecuadorians poisoned by Chevron. Corporate power coupled with judicial abuse has run roughshod over the rights of a human rights lawyer pursuing justice in the largest case of oil-related environmental destruction in history. Chevron's attacks on Donziger must be stopped. The U.S. government must free Donziger today and investigate the ongoing violations and abuses by Chevron and its lawyers. Join Nobel laureates Greenpeace USA, Global Witness, Amazon Watch, Rainforest Action Network, and other activists call for the immediate release of human rights lawyer Stephen Donziger. Stand up to big oil.